Hey everybody, this is Melissa. If you've been here before, welcome back. If this is your first time, welcome. And if you haven't done so already, I'd really appreciate it if you take just a quick second and click that subscribe button. And that way, you'll be the first to know when I upload a new tutorial. I'm so excited you're all here, so let's go ahead and get started. So today I'm in Google Sheets and I'm gonna show you how to randomize a list. Now there's more than one way that we can do this, so I'm gonna show you a hard way. And then I'm gonna show you how easy Google Sheets has made it to do this. So I have some data here that consists of ID, first name, last name, and then I have a sort key column. And the first way that we're gonna do this is we're gonna put a random number into all of these cells that'll help us sort this data. Now we can go about that a couple of ways. We can type in equals rand and open and close our parentheses and hit enter and it's gonna create that random number. Or we can go to our functions, do our drop down, go to math, rand, enter, okay? Now at this point, we can pull all of these down to create a random number for each one. Now if we start with A1 and our header and we hit control shift right, control shift down, that selects all of our data and all of our numbers. Now if we go to data, sort range, tell it our data has headers, and we tell it we wanna sort by the sort key column, ascending, and tell it to sort, now you have a random list of data. Now, I'm going to undo this all by Control Z. Now there is an easier way to do this because Google has made this so, so easy. If we start on the first row that does not have a header, do not include your headers, Control Shift and click on last name. We don't wanna do Control Shift on our right arrow because we don't wanna include this this time. Then if we do Control Shift down, it has selected all of this data. We right click and we randomize the range. And now you have a random list of data. How easy was that? <laughs> that was awesome. If you found this video helpful, please be sure to like it, subscribe to my channel, and get notified. And I'll be back tomorrow with another tutorial. Thanks so much for watching.